Hey everyone, this is Brian Marino with Apex Software. And in this video, I wanted to go over how to find and remove an area in your sketch. I've been getting quite a few calls on this. Users will have areas in their sketch that show zero square feet, and they're not sure how to find or remove that area. So in this video, I'm going to go over how to find the area and how to remove it. So for this example, let's say we have a sketch, we're trying to save it into an appraisal program and maybe it's not transferring over, or we're trying to print and we're getting an error, or we see zero square foot in the calculation breakdown of that area. Those are a few things that would happen if you have an open area in your sketch. So first off, let's go ahead and confirm that we do have an open area. So the way you can confirm whether or not you have an open area if you click on view and you go to view calcs you can clearly see in the calculation panel here I have an area uh, 0.0, .0 square feet and my first floor is listed twice so the way this most likely happened was I reopened my first floor I made some changes to it I did not reclose it and then I just defined the area again well that original area that we reopened is still out there and it's not closed so that's why it's showing the zero there for the square footage. So the way we're going to remove that area, I'm going to go to the pointer arrow at the top of the left toolbar here. And then under the Home tab, I'm going to click on Select. And then I'm going to go to Select Area. Okay, That's going to give me an area selector. It's going to have a list of all the areas on the page I'm on. So on this page here, I see that very top first floor. That's actually the one I want to get rid of. So I'm going to go ahead and select the area. You'll notice on the left here, it highlights it. So it's kind of showing me where that where those lines are for that open area. Once we have it highlighted, we can go ahead and close this panel. And then you can either hit delete on your keyboard. I'm going to go ahead and click the delete button up top here, but either one should work. And now if you notice on the calculation panel on the right side, that area has been removed from the sketch. So from this point, you can go ahead and save your sketch or print it, and you should be back up and running. If you have any questions on this, feel free to drop them in the comments section below. If you know anyone who would be interested in this, feel free to like, share, and or subscribe so you don't miss out on any updates. Otherwise, I will catch you on the next one.